get it, man, I swear that she can get it, say it. Welcome back to my channel. This is Adrian Monique. I'm just doing a quick get ready with me. I'm about to go to brunch with my cousins. So I'm just trying to get cute. Yeah, it's going to be pretty simple. I want to kind of go for a neutral look too because I still don't know what I'm going to wear. I have an idea, but like I'm still trying to figure it out. We shall see. <laughs> I went to MAC the other day. I actually got color matched for their foundation and um because I never, I never knew what shade I was. So I'm like okay well i want to know what shade i am and the girl matched me perfectly i thought i was nc45 but i'm nc44 so she gave me like a sample she said i can get to like four to five uses out of it i'm like really little cute little little thing real cute but first i want to start with my um eyebrows 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 and i got something for my camera so i'm not going to have any type of battery issues anymore so that's a plus okay okay let me do these eyebrows 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 without any distractions had a bad eyebrow day because that's what I'm having right now let's continue all right so I'm gonna be using my um what is this called the Jackie Aina the Jackie Aina palette with um Anastasia Beverly Hills sorry guys <laughs> all right so I'm gonna go into ginger I actually really really love this palette like every time I'm doing my like go-to eye is usually just like a brown crease a warm brown crease and a gold lid because <laughs> that's pretty much what we're gonna be doing today but yeah um it just makes me happy yeah I just feel like she made this this palette for the girls and the girls like just all of us oh now my eyebrows are looking better now that I whatever okay okay I'm gonna go into credit get your credit I'm just gonna put that in the outer V just to deepen that area over there see how much definition it already gives you like I just love it so yeah I'm gonna go to this restaurant supposedly it's supposed to be like this this bougie restaurant because we saw the prices and I was like oh baby this food better be good for this foolishness because if it's not I'm gonna be mad we could have just went to BJ's <laughs> or something like girl okay see like I love that like I just love that already like I just I'm here for it <laughs> so I'm trying to figure out do I want to actually go into one of the golds in this palette or do I want to go I'm gonna go into a gold into another palette Leary. my favorite palette y'all y'all know because it's got my favorite um eyeshadow teddy baby is that what it's called Silk Teddy. <gasps> Silk Teddy Baby. That's what it's called. Um, well, it's called Silk Teddy, but I add a baby to it at the end because I love it. Um, but I want to go into like this gold color genie right here in this. Um, there are shimmers in this in this palette. It's just out of this world. And I'm here for it. Like they're so smooth. Like ColourPop did the damn thing with this palette. And I just wanted to add. Ooh, 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 ooh. Look at that. I'm gonna put it all right here and then put it on the other one. Oh, I put it in the crease. Uh, or I put it a little too far on this eye. It's okay because we're gonna fix that. Um, let me just take some more of that. Um, what's that called? The color called G Ginger. The Jackie Ina palette. And just blend in. Because I kind of want this to be like soft on the softer side i want to actually go into um idle hours or is it idle hour yeah it's idle hour it's like this shimmery white color but it's real pretty you 
you know it's so funny because every time I do my eyebrows and like eye makeup and all that stuff it's always just it just never fails it's always just one eye that just comes out looking just so much better and it's like how the heaven oh she's cute so I want to go in and kind of I don't know just line my eyes just a little bit um, I'm using the Kat Von, is this what it is? This is um, a liner called House Laboratories from House Laboratories and it's just black. And I haven't decided if I want a wing. I think I just want to just line the eyes a little bit of an extra feel like a little to kind of make the lash line look a little bit fuller because my <laughs> I'm going through my fall shed so my lashes are just falling out and that's not cute when you got lash extensions it's just not cute I like that all right okay <laughs> let's go into with the face because it's one o'clock and I gotta really gotta go because we gotta be there at like 2 30. I'm just gonna do this then I guess crazy because she said this was my perfect match but it seems like it's so much lighter like I don't know but see it blends in so wonderfully it looks like it's kind of too light on here because of the lighting that I guess I have but mm -mm, it look good yeah that looks really good actually go in with the conceal and Perfect concealer in the color 145. It's called Warm Beige. Oh damn! I forgot to wet my sponge. Oh. All right, so we're just gonna pat that in. First time actually start uh, actually using this um, concealer and I, I really like it. It's brightening and everything and I don't have to really use a lot just to make it come through concealer. Have I found my new duo? I don't like putting a lot of makeup on my forehead, but we're just gonna go for it. And then I think I'm gonna do some cream contour. So I'm gonna take my Juvia's Place like foundation stick in the color, I think, what is it, Zambia? Yeah, Zambia. And I'm just going to contour right here. Probably with a little too ham right there. And then right here, right here. I kinda wanna do the nose. I'll just do maybe just a little bit child I don't know right here right here right here looks like I'm about to get a facelift Ooh, I should have did my baby hairs before now I gotta don't go around them so when I do my contour I like to push up you know, just push up I like this because it chisels out my face and it actually adds some warmth back to my face as well. Because you know, foundation can kind of flatten you out. Which is what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to be create like this even tone to your skin, so. Blend, 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 blend. Blend, blend. Ooh, my hair hurt. <laughs> Um, and then I'm going to take this brush and kind of just pat this in. You guys, I hate doing nose contour because I just, I don't know. I feel like I'm not that great at it. I just feel like I do it just because... Yeah, it looks kind of cool. 
all right all right all right so now i'm gonna go do like the setting part like i'm gonna do my powder and the powder i've been feeling lately has been my um beauty bakery powder in cassava it's the their setting powder yeah cassava it's the yellow tinted powder yo like their powders are just i don't know they just give you like this blurred effect and it's just so pretty it's just so pretty i just can't get these freaking creases out if you can wrong with me why did I do that oh that was horrible <laughs> that was absolutely horrible I should have blew first <laughs> Jeez. oh I'm about to just the excess off we're going to set the rest of the face with the um, Fit Me powder in, what is it, 330. I just like using this to just set the rest of my face because it kind of just does like this blurred effect. And it just, just sets everything in. It just doesn't look cakey either. I like it. Now for my favorite part <laughs> is the contour. And you know, I'm just, I probably won't ever use anything different. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. I mean, there's other things that I do use, but this is just always my go-to. I never get tired of using it. Just gonna warm this face up. And set the rest of this contour too. But we're just gonna warm this face up. Okay. So I'm just looking at my monitor, and y'all, like, this is looking so cute. Like the face, the face. And I want to go in with a blush. Not sure which blush yet, but I know I want it to come from this um, the Saharan Blush Vol Volume 2 palette. I do want to go into that. And I don't know, Sola, Tau, Lena. I'm going to go into Tau, which is like this orange. It's like a corally color, but you know, it's really pretty. Cause I just want my face to be just warm. <laughs> See, I love that. I feel like coral is like my color. You know when you're doing blush, you want to go up with it too. Cause you want to like make your face go up. <laughs> For the lips. Okay guys, so I found it and I'm happy. Um, it's my um, <laughs> NYX lingerie push up. And I just went off camera and I put um, some mascara on my bottom lash line and a liner in my waterline as well. And um, I don't know, should I, I should probably do that too. I just, I never do it. I don't know why, but I just never think to put um, any shadow on the lower lash lines. Probably because I just, part of it is out of laziness and other part of it is just, I don't think the look be calling for it. But today well, we're going to do it. But I got a glimpse of myself in the mirror and baby, my makeup looks beautiful. Just in the bathroom, I'm like, I look like, I just professionally got my face done. Like, period. It happens when you're talented. <laughs> but I'm trying to hurry up and go now. So I'm gonna just take my lip, my NYX lingerie push-up and what is it called, after hours. And it's like a lipstick, but I like to use it as a liner. And it kind of gives you like this tingling feeling because it's supposed to like plump up your lips or whatever. I'm going to add a little bit of color to my lips too. I 
it's a pretty color. Basically, it was the Maybelline Super Stain Matte Ink in the color 150 Pathfinder. That's pretty. It's pretty. Ooh, it's pretty. It's giving. It's giving. Ooh, it's giving. It's giving. So let me make sure I take these and packing them in my purse. It's real subtle, but my mole's right there. <laughs> I like to bring it out. And um, highlighter. Yes, I want this one. This one. Yes. <laughs> and I'm gonna go into ooh, which one? Bronze, I think. Is that the one? Yeah, that's the one. Cause I just I don't want nothing like crazy. But at the same time, I do. I want it just golden, you know. Got a rush now because I'm pretty white. And I usually always, almost always layer these. So let me just go into tourmaline. Just to give it a little bit of extra. Because I like how tourmaline and bronze looks together. Oh. Girl, your girl's killing it. I'm going to go into silk teddy, baby. Because why not? Now I'm going to go in. I'm going to do it in my inner corner. The love I have for Silk Teddy, baby, it goes unmatched. I gotta go and I still don't know what I'm gonna wear, y'all. Go in there with credit and just... Um, there you go. There, it's done. It's finished. But Silk Teddy, baby, has stolen the show yet again, guys. Okay, so we're done. And <laughs> we need to um, set our face. Everything looks really good, though. here for it I think I know what I'm gonna wear I'm just gonna have to go with it because I'm gonna be running late if I don't let's just get it done okay so I done did my baby hairs real quick ciao <laughs> I don't know I think I'm gonna keep my hair in a bun we'll see um but this is the final look really pretty but I really really like this look um, it's just beautiful this... <laughs> um, yes and I am in love with that Mac foundation so I'm gonna definitely use it and this concealer was bomb too yeah this concealer and that Mac foundation it's a good duo like it's a thing it's a thing how do you guys love it do you like it? I love it. I want it. I need it. <laughs> okay, let me just... I'll be back. Okay, guys. So, I am dressed... I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be late. <laughs> um... So I uh, am dressed, so I just want to just describe to you guys what I'm wearing. So I'm wearing some jeans that I got from JCPenney. There's some straight leg jeans. They're raw cut, so they got a little bit distressing on the actual jeans. And then like on the hem of the jeans, they're a little um, frayed, kind of give it that like distressed look or whatever. And I decided to just pair that with um, some open toed strappy heels it's not going to be cold outside it's still kind of like spring slash summer here in texas so um yeah so yeah i'm doing that and then i have on just a regular cropped like top but i like this top because it kind of holds you and kind of like sucks you in it's from shein i love this top like i want to go and get some more because it's like a bra in a t in a in a it's like a bra and a crop top like into one. And then I also got um, this black sheer jacket because it's not gonna be like hot, but it's gonna be like a little bit of a breeze and I just want something that's breathable. So, you know, cause I'm kind of wearing the crop. I don't wanna just wear the crop top by itself. <laughs> I'm not that confident yet, but yes. Um, I just feel like it just adds a little bit of extra to it the jewelry I got um I feel like I got these both from Shein I feel like this one though was a set from Amazon 
I have to find it. If I find it, I'll link it because I feel like I got this a long time ago. But if I can find it, I'll link it. But the earrings are from Shein. Um, the black strappy shoes are from Amazon. I'll link those below too. Um, yeah, so the two, the top part, both from Shein. And yeah, I love it. Hi guys, I also forgot to talk about the purse that I'm going to be bringing to. This is the purse from Red Dress freaking love it freaking love it it's giving me chanel vibes like i just i love it i've talked about this dress in my last video so yes go check go check that one out <laughs> and um yeah bye this is just like a little messy bun that i'll probably fix up just a little bit when i go but i just like throwing my hair up in a bun honestly i feel like it just looks the messier it is like it doesn't like if it's not perfect like it looks that just makes it look even better because it's like all loppy or whatever like i like that so yeah and i just actually washed it so i want it up and off of my neck oh and as far as the fragrance they didn't come in they're not in so i can't put them on i'm still waiting for them to come in so i'm just going to be putting on this rose fragrance mist from bath and body works y'all know i love rose actually the fragrance that i'm ordering it's like a perfume rose so i want to see how that smells like mm, i love rose i love rose it don't matter what time what season i love rose i'll be putting this in my purse too so yes um that completes the look and um thank you guys so much for watching we're gonna go to the pseudo modes. We're gonna go to the pseudo modes.